channel welcome back to day 20 of vlogmas today's episode i am just going to update my calendar i have some orders to pull and i just want to briefly talk about my goals for 2022 i'm not gonna lie i am starting to lose steam i can't believe i'm on day 20 of vlogmas I just decided on a whim to do this series just because I wanted to get comfortable in front of the camera again. I wanted to get used to uploading content daily. Thank you guys so much for following up on this little series and let's go ahead and get started. So I thought I'd give you a little tour of this spare bedroom that I've been using to photograph and you know, I do keep some inventory in here. Actually, I have an order to pull down here. I have some so my three people stuff. So I do have one of ooh, yeah, one of my shirts is down here that sold. So I did sell one of these three people shirts. Oh my god. There should be a small somewhere in here. What? Yeah, so I think this is the last small and I only have like five large left. So this sold on eBay. I'm gonna ship that. And then my other sale is in my storage unit. So I'm gonna have to go get that. I do keep like shipping supplies in here and some other items. That closet is full. Um, I've been using this little corner to photograph because I'm gonna list these today, these little kid, um, little vans. I thought they were so cute, like with the little Pegasus and the unicorn. My calendar, I'm gonna delete this. And yeah, this is where I keep boxes. That's all inventory that I have to list, some presents, and my third bag. So I do want to keep this room as clean as possible. It's really messy right now. And it used to be even more messy because we actually use this room for guests like when my grandma comes to stay with us so she might be coming after the holidays so i i don't want to you know have the room be so messy that she can't stay here you know i have to clear all of this stuff off the bed obviously i'm gonna move my boxes and um her stuff is in the closet and that other chest of drawers so um i'm trying to keep this room clean which is why i have my storage unit and like nothing fits in my room so and that's it. I don't keep my reselling stuff anywhere else in my parents' house. So for now, it'll just do and we'll see what 2022 brings. Like if I end up moving or I don't know, we'll see. You'll have to stay tuned and see where I end up in 2022. I am going to my storage unit and I just wanted to show you how close it is to my house. Um, it took me, it's under two miles away and it took me six minutes to get there just because, you know, stop signs and red lights. So once I got there, I had to pull this dress. I just have this tub and this tub is for more formal wear and longer dresses. So I just knew that this dress was in that little tub and again, I don't have the best storage inventory system. I just kind of like eyeball it and know where everything is. I'm at the point where I still can do that. I don't have a crazy amount of listings. So I kind of just know where everything is right now. And I'm back home and all together it took me under 20 minutes to go to my storage unit and get this dress. I do like going every day to my storage unit and pulling orders if I have sales every day. Because I do like to ship within 24 hours, especially now during the holidays. Even though nobody has actually reached out to rush me on shipping, 
I just do it as a courtesy. So I'm using this 14 by 20 poly mailer for this dress because it is um, a larger dress. I didn't want to fold it too much in half. And it's under 16 ounces, so it can ship first class. So I do have some larger poly mailers for this size, which I got on Amazon. And I'll be able to ship it first class using pirate ship i think i do have free shipping attached to my etsy orders so it won't be a problem as long as they're under a pound i don't mind paying up for shipping so that's it for today's video i just want to thank you guys so much for keeping up with this series and yeah about those goals for next year i'm really taking the time to plan out what i want definitely obviously make more sales i want to level up my etsy and just get more listings up i'm also thinking about upgrading to an ebay store but just definitely being more concrete about my goals so i'm definitely setting a goal for 2022 because i feel a way that I hold myself back is just by saying that I'm a part-time reseller and you know I do this for fun and I have a full-time job and I don't really need the money that I make reselling it's just money that goes into a savings account because you know my salary I'm just at the place now where my, like my salary provides me with a livable wage and good benefits so now but I still have some outstanding debt so definitely have more concrete goals and set goals and how i'm gonna apply my reselling to meet those goals so definitely stick around um i'm doing vlogmas up until the 25th and i honestly don't know for the 24th and the 25th um what i'm going to be posting i don't know if i'll have any sales I'll probably just share my new listings and like I did today, anything that sells and how I pack it. And yeah, so the 25th is the last day for Vlogmas, but I do plan on doing one final video, maybe on the 30th or the 31st, where I talk about my goals for next year. And that's where I'll tell you all about them. And then early in the new year, definitely give you my total summary of what my solds were on Poshmark, how much I sold on Etsy, um, any trends that I noticed, some specific months, and more about my goals. So yeah, thank you guys so much for watching. Take care and I'll see you tomorrow. Bye.